Hey guys, Aloha Mongoose here, and today, uh, sorry, I was supposed to get this out, um, this video out, uh, yesterday, but, uh, work, man, I'm gonna tell you that right now, um, but, yeah, this video is gonna be on the Koenigsegg, or Koenigsegg, um, Egera. it's a new Class R car that's added to the showroom, um, Right now, there's like about a couple hours left to it, but probably by the time that uh, this video is released, 50% uh, off will be gone, and it'll be at 1,600 gems. I'm gonna purchase a couple more later for a couple of my friends that wanted, um, not gonna buy for anyone else, as the friends that I'm buying it for are VIPs. So... Yeah, I purchased it uh, yesterday when it was released. I just got it just so I can get it out of the way and go straight into making this video. Now we're going to look at its stats here and see what's up. So the weight is 3,164 pounds. Its power is at 90, 960 horsepower with a torque of 811. Everything else is, you know as is there's no conversions into it no tires or anything like that uh the thing that made me really sad about this car is you can't repaint it so everyone's uh Koenigsegg is gonna be the same but yeah you can put on some crate rims on it at least um <laughs> Nothing else you can't uh, put on any body kits or anything. The suspension is alright. You can't even see the change in the drop. But it's already low as it is. But anyways, enough talk. Let's get to racing into a multiplayer lobby. And I... Since I purchased it, I never raced it yet. So I have no idea what this car is going to do and what am I going to expect and apparently there's no bots so oh there is one actually I spoke too soon we're just going to race up against this CUDA here and yeah let's do this let's try to drop launch probably on the second light pretty good 10 seconds not bad not bad had horrible shifting though and a horrible launch let's do a couple more runs really don't know I might just I don't know I'm thinking what I should what I should do with this car I have a little bit more money racing rivals cash in before Either gonna max this out. I totally messed up there. <laughs> oh man. Let's just lead shift it. It takes off pretty quick. Car has some power though. Not a good run, but something. Alright. So let's try it on boost, see how fast it goes. 1,800 boosts. Why not? And of course someone messages me while I'm doing a video. Alright. So it's on the second light. Maybe not on the second light. Either that or my freaking... Reaction time sucks for this car. Goes a little bit faster with my crappy reaction time, but it's all good. As you guys can see, this is the um, Koenigsegg um, Agora. New car that is added to the showroom. 
if you guys didn't purchase this car for half off, uh, good luck getting 1,600 gems. Uh, which is actually not a lot when you think about it. Because um, all you have to do for a um, when you're buying gems and you do have the money for it. What I like to do is I like to purchase this $10 one first. The 460 after this purchase, there's a 30% off of the 20, and it comes like 1,000 something gems, which will be, I think will be around enough to get two, but yeah. If you buy a pack of gems, buy a cheap one, so you can get the next big one. So like if you buy a five, the 499 one, the 990, the, for your next pur purchase, the 999 will have like some kind of like have a certain percent more than the original and then you want to purchase it there so that's a little thing you guys can do for buying gems and that's another way how i stack up on gems a lot is when i do that i also wait for um like just special offers and all that stuff and i take advantage of that if you want if you want to play this game and have the experience that i do you gotta have money Alright guys, uh, till next video, aloha, and see you guys next time.